okay, all right, okay. All right, all right so there's this oh video gosh. that has been trending mm-hmm. on social media yeah. um, about the NDLEA going to a an Instagram celebrity's house, Instagram comedian, the general. I don't know who he is. I, I really well, don't like, care for Instagram know. comedians. Personally, I don't think they are funny. They must be. But, okay, but, <laughs> He was now he went live mm. on his and I think I like that when things are happening like this instead of just recording because people are like oh you recorded we don't know if it's real you just press live on Instagram. But mm. this government also. We, do, but them. even if they would question it, we <laughs> that, that know what live is won't question it. So <laughs> this young man was uh, they these people came into his house and it it when you look at the video it's mm. at night and maybe they wanted to search his house or whatever and he's like. You know why? You know, telling them that, okay, they were having a problem with him making a video, and it was like he wants to make a video so people can see what is going on. Is it is his right? And the man was like, "What rights?" You know. And next thing, oh, it got violent. Like they hit the phone on the ground and then, like, beat him up. Wow. And I'm, I'm question was like, NDLA is that how we do? You, you know? sure they're they were wearing their jackets. You know that they are red jackets. Yeah, people can they... wear that jacket now. Oh. Let's go. We behave your less time. Tell us if we can't be no, no, no. <laughs> this, this just happened you know? uh, today. I think the video was up today. So wow. It is tomorrow they will come out and tell us whether oh. they are the ones or not. You know how when EFCC went to broke into Dorothy but 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 Bachelor's house yeah. mm. from a big brother Niger when she it was in there they said no we didn't go there. Okay, yes, we went there. Well we just took her. We did not we break did not, we did not break into the, the house. Yes. We didn't do this yeah. and that. Yeah. Yeah. Conversation. Very familiar, you know, yes, we were the two Meanwhile days, the no, video we there. saw was not mm. that mm. so we need them to explain to us if you're coming to do you have a warrant to get it to come yeah. you know you see in the middle of the night you do your searches yeah. are you supposed to yeah. hit yeah. him yeah mm. Did they, because okay, i don't know so why we are so prone to violence if, if somebody no. has done wrong arrest the person put them in handcuffs i don't mind the handcuffs exactly. i take them away why do you have to beat them up apart from that even the style of just barging <laughs> into people's houses even at night which at that time you even be scared when somebody even knocks on your gate at that set at time. that time of the yes. night you're not sure if you're not even sure no. yes or anything then you just barge into people's houses and you know what and... it also goes through people's minds that what if these people are not the yes, yes. Exactly. what if they're not the actual what people they have those because yeah. the fact yes. that they're wearing the uniform doesn't necessarily mean, mean that they mean. Mean. if they refuse yeah. to open now they'll say oh it was uh, the you obstructing, you to obstructing us uh-huh. to carry out our, our okay, duties yeah. uh, right. okay, okay there's, need, there's a video <laughs> there's a video i saw it, it's not funny but it's funny of people oh. trying to quench <laughs> fire <laughs> a train caught fire in oh worry mm. yes and why do we Which try to go? Which train goes to and The worry is that they're lying now. You know that we have trains this that go they say mm. One of the newly mm. procured worry it's like a standard gauge train coaches was on Tuesday evening. Yes, oh got there with God. fire. So a video was showing how people were trying to put up the fire. I um You could see like fire extinguishers on the floor. Maybe they've exhausted that. Mm-hmm. So they had to become innovative. They used palm leaves like the trees to start mm. you know, trying to... Uh, to beat it, to beat the fire. fire. Yeah. 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 Panic, panic. Uh, when people, when the truth is, if that wasn't a fire that, um, can I use the phrase, the word large? If it wasn't a fire that is of that, that you know, mm. um, magnitude or intensity, that would do something, mm. right? Yes, that yeah. can do something if it's a fire that's within a small space. If you use that, you can actually put mm-hmm. out a yeah. fire. Mm. So when you are in that kind of situation, sometimes you put you, your you just, brain and you know, just thinking, that comes, oh, if I what, use it, if work, I use that, yeah. you are sitting at a distance. That's why you can, you know, think more, think more process it and see like sure. what were they thinking that they want to do with this well, that yeah, they were she, not said, thinking she said, that. She said the, um, M- like maybe empty canisters yeah, so, or, uh, they finish those now like what time is there rafa is there sand and, and, is, and it's not like you could see it's like the bushy part so that's the only option they have at that time because now this is where you find one what happened to the twins eventually so they didn't say what happened after it and all that 
but our our emergency response again, again. Mm-hmm. but that well, has to be in the train because yes, if you because look at that location it's, it's just it's, um, how the the outside, they need to yeah. i don't know what they have but within. even if you know if you if you won't look at all these this uh developed country i'm suspecting when you start talking like this i start you to know, suspect in the developing <laughs> countries the one that they've developed small we were still developing Wait, they gosh. have at least some some emergency emergency response yeah. even in remote areas no this this is as uh, i don't know maybe they have to fly uh, a fire extinguisher or something to that place that's but, but, the only but, option but with um, the location that we're looking at right now it's but, not something that they, somebody can they can drive to yes. or you know but inside to, that train they yeah. should have been but that, if we that can works. have police stations in the hinterlands i feel we can have fire service in the hinterlands we'll get there, so. no we, we don't know but is it all the lands you want to have them like every stop uh, do you know why we have sure police like in a this stop. country this is, between, this this is, is between, like in between you understand yeah. Yeah. and again we, one of but the staff be far from one of these you know small they will not want to risk it see like what queen rita said we are sitting afar so we're already making suggestion of what could be done mm-hmm. but at that moment in time they just yeah, had to that is just what that's, they're that's just thinking no, about. That's what I'm, saying. The I'm saying in, in this country, you have police stations in very remote, remote locations. The if we can have that, I know in that some remote locations. Mm-hmm. In some, okay. Okay, if we can have that, we can also have for emergency services. Very that's what true. I'm saying. We, we have a long way to go. We when it do, comes we to do. Yes, services, we do. Really. We do have a long mm. way to go. Both as, uh, Even the as ones individuals in, inside the town and that as we, a we, we are in. As you individuals, know. yes, like after yes, three as hours. individuals, we do. If you go to our houses, how many of us actually have, have fire extinguishers? Oh. Oh. Some people have fire How many fire of us have fire extinguishers in our car? Oh. And even I though you I have, do, check. I do. 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 I <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Confess to the F R healthy. My house expired. We have, we have a expired. <laughs> yeah, live or radio. Yes. True confession. You can see her face. <laughs> <laughs> She's she 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 What's happening? Hello. What's happening? What's happening? Usually it's Toya that we're dragging. We need to go and L-D-I-G. check them. We even had to do a disclaimer when she said something. Because I said it's Toya that said it. By, so. You know I said it by joke. I'm like, oh, disclaimer. <laughs> why are you disclaiming people dragging? We don't even drag. Toya, you guys are not here. Oh, God. Right. Look at the time. We need to go on a break now. Yeah. Beautiful fab. All right. <laughs> okay. okay. This is a sister sister show. Hi, this is the first I'm gonna be on this year. Hello. Happy New Year! Happy this is Queen Rita. The Queen of the Airways over here. She's tired. Yeah, yeah. No. no. Yeah. These days anybody that sends me messages. This hell gave her. This see, 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 see hell gave her. The, so there's anybody that sends me messages on social media. Hey, I say this issue. Click on this hey, link, help me vote. I'm not the vote though. Hey. But you click on link, that's how they okay. vote. Okay, so we're account. on a commercial yeah. break. Yeah. And after this that, we're going to talk about the um, music for, for segment. It's going to be short. <laughs> and just tell you, give you a few tips for the kitchen. Like and then we can talk about children. And you don't really think that much sugar is giving you money. So this is the first live I would do on Instagram. But I do this every every week. Jojo. I come to the sister sister show. Um, what are you I click on? I said, they have to do about about 20 to 30 And again, please, that's the problem. Today's topic is not the first or second time. These people that will send you messages to say somebody's owing why money. Why you need to raise you as your as children the next with or whatever, that please. Please. And what this is on them, too. They don't know hey. how it positions them. What you're doing against the game? Because hang in and enjoy the behind the scenes conversation. We now want you to be able to get on the ground. They always have permission to go through contact. Permission to use your camera. Thanks for joining. Yeah, I see I you. Designer so Steve, thank you for joining. Is you've not seen, you've not seen thank you for talk, joining. Talk, talk about all thank you for joining the Bless. Bless. Continue. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. If I would search for Thanks. nails thank now, all my ads on Instagram. Instagram. No, that it one is that yes. even good. You searched now. You understand? You searched. Talk. Who's in the middle of the kitchen? 
Duck liver. Yeah, the foie gras. They, they say very, it's like in the, in the uh-huh. category of like all these caviar. Uh-huh. If, you only, if, yeah. if you like it, you like it. Oh, yeah, no, you need to address <laughs> this to people. Oh, hmm. quite said hmm. he, he would so even give a private jet to Elder oh. G so that he will leave Tonya alone for, oh her, my God. for him. Oh, uh-uh. my God. Wow. Yeah, right. <laughs> wow. Okay, I'm just here picking my nails. Welcome to the Kitchen Net segment on Sister Sister. All right, welcome back to the Sister Sister Show. On today's KitchenEd segment, I will be telling you some food myths that we need to get rid of in this country. I thought this is not good anything. Yeah. Well, we, you want to me to... we need to bring back Giver Bell's Kitchen. It's been a long time. Giver Bell's Kitchen. Continue, yes. continue, yeah. continue. Yeah. continue. Okay. All right, the very first one is that you have to peel your beans before making akara. Thank you. Hey, I'll give her this is not your segment. <laughs> What's wrong with it? <laughs> No, no it's a myth that, that you must, have you to must peel. peel beans. You don't have to. What about no. moi moi? You don't have to peel. Huh. Oh, I've been talking. So, 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 so here's the thing. And <laughs> to be a uh, uh, disclaimer, it didn't always have to be time to peel the beans. Exactly. And that's why I used to get so discouraged whenever I feel like eating a car, I'm like, I'm not peeling beans. Until I saw it somewhere on social media and I tried it and I was like, it tastes the same. Did you make, is it about the yeah. taste, the texture? Texture. I say taste and texture. Okay. The same so where did they thank you? So there? apparently before when they used to grind it with the stone, the peel needed to come off. I think it didn't grind well with the peel. So we took that one from from our ancestors. ancestors. Now brought it to 2022. Well, we using blender. Thank you. I don't. I will make small first. Sorry, because I'm trying. I'll make small. All right. Thank you. The second one is that. Maltina and milk will help you do some dis- blood, blood. Yes, blood no Wait, leave, that leave that thing alone. Oh. <laughs> Mal- please leave it. Please. Everything is it's changed. not fair. Just leave that thing alone. Toy. We love milk it like that. It's not even just that oh, one. Do you know what they want to do? do? We love what does that one do? It's the same, same blood, blood tonic. tonic. We love Stout and milk. Love love one. Love one. And, milk. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's this other um, myth that if you have mango and gari, you will die. Yeah. <laughs> Is it mango and Gary or mango and Coke? Oh, That's joy. all of the above. <laughs> I still don't eat that Coke. combination. I, you know, I was even told. But wait, why would you have? No, but let us reason this thing. Why would you have? It's what is that go available? But no, why? But what if you have like mango now? Yes. Five minutes later, you have Gary. Because, because you have any if, what if, if you have you, you do your Gary, then you now slice mango. Why would you do that to yourself? Why? But the, but the bottom line is like you won't die. Also. Very <laughs> delicious. Then now you want to step it down. You now take a bottle of Coke. Yes. Not mango, just <laughs> cold. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. And then there's this other one that you cannot have eggs and dairy together. So there's some it's people too that much richness. No, but it's no matter how can you wait, know, you're going to not have blotted some of that. Uh, yeah. 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 No, no, if I, so people that are not know, but they say it is poisonous that you will die. It's no. poisonous, so for me. <laughs> no, <laughs> what it depends on. She does not take to, uh, lactose. No, she does yeah, not. Yeah, yeah, no, me too. I mean, that's what I realized. I was lactose intolerant. I was visiting, I was in Benue, I was coming to Abuja. Someone made. um. What do you call this thing? Uh, cereal, right? With milk. Yeah. And then gave me fried egg. Omo, we thank the Lord that I survived the trip from Benin is, to Abuja. That is if you are lactose intolerant. Like, 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 like us. We know ourselves. Ah. But for on a normal day, it is not poisonous. And lactose intolerance is also not poison. No, so it's not. It is, those are two it's different things. Body, yeah, so please, think. just... <laughs> but don't, don't, how are you eating egg and dairy? It's too much. Look at the No, wait, oh, no, wait now. So you, when you have bread and egg, you won't drink tea. Is it not? Big? No, take another. Don't take the. Why, why are you drinking tea? Um, why would, why you, would you drink tea? Because, because you're eating egg and bread. Have you had a, a sister, a queen, Richard? No, but that's how you do it. Why you balance diet? But wait, you don't have to, but people do. When I'm drinking Earl Grey, I can't drink Earl Grey without milk. So I know it's a Friday. Queen Richard knows me. It's a Friday I meet her because I know Saturday, Sunday, I'm going nowhere. But wait, anything that happens, wait, happens. I, wait, wait, Tony. So you're trying to say when you give people bread and egg, they shouldn't take tea? No, no, it's just Elgrey. You can't say without. Must you have milk? Why not? Yeah. Actually, I can't, I can't really stand That's how like you have to, you know, wash it, step it down. Like, yeah, that's, 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 that's why <laughs> James doesn't like that's it. That's why you have fruit juice. That is a different something. No, you, you want to snack. You have to snack with fruit juice. It's, you can also have tea. <laughs> 
tea is nice coffee if you like that that kind of thing anyway that's all i have for kitchen and segment my name is tonya i'll give her it's bad vibes that's why that's why they always today they will drag you all right so we'll be right back uh, our child nurturer is in the building hello this is this called matanga south east all and show my josie Hope you enjoy that segment. We let them know. <laughs> we don't have no fun. Imagine you, you, we don't you have this show. If right you listen to Toya, no, if that guy should let you call on this show. See, mom's and milk, you have to keep taking it. Mom's and milk. We're taking it too much. It's for your health. You keep it out of the way. Now that you come and wait, oh, traffic jam, so you knock call. Actually, Are you guys leave, something, something. leave yesterday alone and talk to them? No, because no, we if you said this issue since last year, even though, even um, that's um, the man. Yeah, 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 do you know that it was this was something I did on the Monday, on the Wednesday in the three traffic jam? This same James called to say you said something about. I was like, you could not send a text message on that day. You are not bringing yeah, today's data yeah. to come and talk about it, it on traffic jam. Sorry, oh, this is we can't talk about. But what he said yesterday, what he said yesterday was that he'll give us a company last week Friday on traffic jam. Sure, you not call her last week. Harassment. About sexual I saw that story. I didn't have time to carry it, but we had prime, we had prime or something. <laughs> Ah, no. Oh, oh, yeah. Ah, no. Hey, Jay. Hey, Jay, Jay. Hi, Fox. Let's see. Hey, Jay. 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 Hey, you ready? <laughs> yes. We're back. Okay. So, all right, we're back. Well, what are they saying in that song? I have no idea. Disco Matanga. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> they are Kenyan. Uh-huh. So he was singing in Luo. Oh. Yeah. Okay. okay. <laughs> a Kenyan and a that, That's how you know those that know. You know what was the interest? What was interesting was Shoma Josie, who was a South African, was singing in Swahili. Don't get, mm-hmm. don't get Tonya started. But South that's, South that's how, singing. that's how UNICEF lovely. people came here to interview me. You see me, they came to interview. Mm. Before I know what on my on my shift, Tonya started <laughs> Frenching them. Hey. hey. On my shift, that you came see the so Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! That's what you do. You're French. I was like, I was like, how come you behave on Friday? But really, we should actually. I don't know why French is not even a serious language because we're basically surrounded. If you check out, who do a show that we're going to speak only French? Go to you. Okay. Actually, what language? The word language. How many of us are speaking English in Ecowas? Like uh, English speaking, I think we're we not are English too... speaking, and that's what matters. Like 15, 16, yes, we are going to speak English, fine. Chad Lodger. <laughs> Welcome to the show. How <laughs> are you, you doing? Happy New Year, by the way. We, 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 we. How is the <laughs> young man doing? He's very well. Fabulous. Good to see you, you. after such a long time. Yeah, such a long time. Um, yeah. yeah. special. Yeah. Sister, sister. Krimita, you were not there. No, I wasn't. <laughs> you missed. Oh, you missed. I wasn't. Mm. Um, yes, yeah, so today you said we're talking about why affirmations are good for your children why you should raise your children with affirmations okay and by affirmation we mean positive, saying positive yeah. things positive yeah. talking i don't know about words. you i have a pen and paper <laughs> okay mm-hmm. first of all before we start let me say let me read out something i saw um earlier in the week i think on monday or sunday on online it was a post i said Speak to your children as if they are the wisest, kindest, most beautiful, and magical humans on earth. For what they believe is what they become. Now, we have a lot of things. We talk a lot about positive thinking and positive talking, being kind to yourselves Mm -hmm. and all that. But we think it's all just adults. We Mm -hmm. forget that the adult comes from the child. And then there's something I can't say enough. Everything that I am today, everything that you ladies are today, as a result of where you're coming from, Mm -hmm. your experiences as a child, Mm -hmm. whether they were good, whether they were bad, it's in the first seven years, for instance, that most of how you feel and how you think are formed. 
And after that, we now build upon and consolidate the good and the bad formed in those first seven years. So we talk about affirmations. We, we, you, if you everywhere on the internet, everywhere you're going to find positive affirmation, positive. But we don't think about the children. We don't think the children are old enough to have affirmations. Now let me tell you a story. <laughs> You know when you started talking, story, I said, story, okay, yeah. Yeah. Like, no, 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 no. A lot of stories. I didn't know the story was written in the wings. Let's but go. it's not actually. It's, a, it's an experience. My experience. That's just a story. My younger brother, who is in his mid going to late thirties, is the smartest. Most in you think I'm smart. You think I'm intelligent. You think I'm bright. You think I'm brilliant. You think, I have nothing on my younger brother. But the kind of confidence that I have, my brother doesn't have that much. So I shine brighter than my younger brother. So everybody easily thinks that I'm the smart, in terms of intelligence, like book, he's ace. Smartness, creativity, innovation, audacity, he, I'm sorry, um, innovation, yes, he's ace. But I seem better than him because of confidence. Do you know why? From when I was maybe three years old, my father called me a name, a cha cha, a cha cha, and, and he called mean? me this name even into my adulthood. A cha cha is a like she he's hitting me. It means in one English word, it means brilliance. Oh wow brilliance and everything i'll just say something that doesn't make sense then you think you're looking for your shit <laughs> look at it here a cha cha like oh you even know where the shoes are you found it and then he, that two plus two is four uh -uh. a cha cha my father was wiring me i don't know if he knew what he was doing but you see i do there is not i don't believe that anything can can challenge me. I don't believe that anything can outsmart me. I think that whatever it is, I can conquer because I'm smart. I'm I'm brilliant. I am a cha cha. He wired me. And so I carried it. And this is what affirmations are. What affirmations do to your children is is this. First of all, a child who has low self-esteem is based on what the child hears often. If a child lives with criticism and condemnation, they learn to be shy. They learn to second guess themselves. Mm -hmm. They learn to feel low. Their esteem is low. Enough. They are not good enough because the child is always being criticized. So if you replace it with something else, mm -hmm. what do you do? You tell the, you let the child believe that I'm enough. I can, I, I will. You know, so these are what affirmations do. So I have a list of things that affirmations do. They boost the child's yeah. esteem. They help the child develop self-love. Mm. Affirmations help a child. Now, affirmations can come in different ways. Affirmations can either be affirmations that a person says to themselves repeatedly or affirmations that people say to that person. Say to that person. All right. So in this case, it could be that you are repeatedly saying these things to your child or you are teaching your child to say these things to themselves. So there are different types of affirmations. Affirmations can be for confidence, for a growth mindset, for success and progress, for tackling challenges, for positive Thinking, as in, I want to be thinking positive, the affirmations for that. For kindness, for developing the softer part of you, there are affirmations, there are different affirmations for different things. Now, if you look at your child, you would see where that child needs help. And you should help the child craft affirmations. Now, affirmations, as I was saying earlier, they help the child boost their self confidence, mm -hmm. they help the child tackle complexes if a child is developing a complex maybe it's something that has developed or something that is developing you see you can help the child beat it a child affirmations can help a child promote the mindset of growth i can i am able to i am this i am that it can help a child combat intrusive negative thoughts 
these thoughts that just keep stopping the child in their tracks, that keep giving them a freeze. Affirmations can do that. Affirmations can help children manage emotions. Children who feel anxious, for instance, whenever they want to write exams, mm. they're like, no, I can do this. I can take a deep breath and I can think calmly. These are affirmations that you can give the child to help the child tackle those emotions, that manage those emotions. Affirmations can help a child develop a can-do spirit, as in, who are they? Where is me or see? Most of the times, the things that I do aren't things that I actually can do. But because I have that belief that where is that thing that can I cannot handle because I am a cha-cha, so you can help a child develop that because affirmations can help that child develop that can do spirit. The child is able to take challenges. You can also affirmations also help help um help a child to tackle belief systems. Mm -hmm. You know belief systems that you have in your family that have gone on for generations, like um um Tonya told us in the kitchen Mama now, died. you know, mm -hmm. and then you be, but we believe this. See, right now, I still cannot drink mango and I don't know what Tonya is saying. Mm -hmm. I cannot mm -hmm. eat mango and, and drink Gabi and drink Coke. These are something I've wabbed. You know, when I heard this, I was in primary school. That's over three decades. And then you can help someone reprofile this by through affirmations. Mm -hmm. What you need to do is, okay, so you let me okay before i get into what you need to do let me just say all the things you can help you can affirmations can help a child tackle trauma a child who's gone through a really traumatic experience or an adverse experience affirmations can help a child get out of it affirmations can help a child develop positive mental and emotional standing emotional states that a mindset that can you know propels them through their entire life affirmations also as i said earlier can help a child manage um anxiety now i want to ask a question how many of us can you think back to you know when we were what think think back to your childhood are there things that your teacher said to you your parents or older relatives said to you growing up that messed up with your thinking are there i have some i don't i can't remember any okay let me share one do you know i was in ss2 i probably was maybe 15 going on 16 mm -hmm. or thereabouts when i thought for the first time that i'm actually beautiful i didn't know i thought i was the ugliest monkey black african monkey why? why why did you think that because a child in my childhood i was seven she said to me she used to say in their living room she would jump on the chair she would say my name is Oge Lui. and so people who can handle Oge Lui just call me Oge. so he said Oge is the blackest monkey in the whole world yay and she said it not once not twice not three times not four times not and her ma I kept looking at her mom and her aunt to say so this thing was happening in Lagos and it mm. happened different holidays, not just one holiday. And I kept waiting for the mother to say something like, no, and she didn't. Wrong. And the, the aunt didn't say anything. And I was like, I have to be the blackest monkey in the whole world. So I believed it. I was seven. Mm. It took six more years right mm -hmm. or is it seven more years no i beg your pardon eight, eight more years before i realized that i'm actually not a monkey black and the ugliest in the world how did i do that because i'm the kind of child that i am i used to just stand in front of a mirror and look at myself oh you're not ugly see you have dimples <laughs> i see you have pointed nose see you and, and i started looking at myself you look at my face there's something here mark i thought it was so ugly can you see it? Everybody, you can't see it from there, but I used to see it. I started to pick things out of off of me to, to just prove that I am ugly. I'm a monkey. I'm ugly, right? I used I have this lobe in my ear, both ears. Um, yeah, look at it. I said, you're a pigsy. You're a pigsy. So you look at your ears are this figure. Because someone said I'm, a, I'm an ugly monkey. Now, a child who has this, 
who can help itself the way I could. I don't know where I got that, but I'm blessed. But there are children who hear this seven years mm. and they live with it. They develop a complex. They never feel beautiful. They feel always self-conscious. Affirmations can help them. But before affirmations help them, you need to notice. True. But even if you didn't notice, it is necessary that even now you help your children to craft affirmations that propels them, that prepares them for life. Now, I'm going to, after this program, I'm going to put on my handles on Instagram, on Facebook, um, um, Elogo, um, Elogo Nadi. Hand, the handle on Instagram is Omelogonadi or a circumspect mom. On Facebook is also Omelogonadi. I'm going to put on them different affirmations that you can use for children, for different things. Children from like two years all the way to 17. Different affirmations. Because for each age grade, there are different sets of affirmations that you can use. So that they, they are age appropriate, that these children can understand that would actually um, 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 benefit them. Okay? Oh, yeah. We need to open the phone lines, right? Yes, yeah, we but wh while do. we're at that, one thing I would like for you to tell us is because you did say there there are some affirmations that yes. we need to say to the children, and there yes. are others we need to we teach, teach them the, to say. Yes. I would like for you to yes. throw more light on yes. that. But let's I will. Open okay, the phone all right then. All right, so the child nurturer is in the building. We're talking about how to you know train our children with uh, positive affirmations. So if you have any question or comments, you want to contribute, call us on zero eight zero nine five 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 zero nine eight three or zero seven zero four three three seven one seven four three send us a whatsapp message zero eight zero nine four 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 zero nine eight three and we're also live on instagram at hot fm underscore abuja all right. So, so yeah, I was saying uh, that there, there are different kinds of affirmations that you can teach the child to say to to himself or herself. And there are some that you can say to the child yourself. These are like positive sentences that you can use and remind the child constantly that can that are like life changing. You can Let's say things to. OK. Call. All right. There's a call coming in. Hello. Hello. Good afternoon. Hello. 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 Good afternoon. What's Hello. your name? Hello. Yes, we, we can, can hear you. you. What's, What's your, your name? name? All right, James. What's your contribution? About what? How will you feel? Okay, answer the question. How will you feel? Yeah, yeah, I will feel bad. Okay, thank you. Okay, um, sorry, Mr. James. Please, today, I don't know what happened yesterday. Right now, I'm on set and we're talking affirmations and why you need to raise your children with affirmations. If you have anything on this, please call on it. If you don't, hold on. When Rita is in charge, as in she's the one talking about stuff, then you can call and ask her this question. That's not even the case. Please. We're done with that topic. We're Let's done with it. On. There's even somebody here now that, is, that sent a message to you know, address what he said yesterday. I'm, I'm not even reading it. Okay, so um, while we wait well, for other you. calls, say, <laughs> while we wait for other calls to come in, I was going to say, yes, there are some words that you can say to your children that are life-changing. Mm -hmm. You know, you can say things like, you can remind them, because affirmations, the way affirmations work uh, is this. You have to repeatedly say them repeatedly remind the child repeatedly remind yourself so it is a repetition that goes into your subconscious to wire it like my father constantly telling me achacha 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 
it wired me made me believe so if for instance how he now helps you for instance um deal with trauma and adverse experiences is you identify what this trauma is or the adverse experiences are and you do what we call reprofiling and recreate it with something positive. replace it with something positive and constantly feed the brain the brain can get manipulated the brain believes what you tell it so once you keep telling this to your brain over and over and over and over it will be it will believe it you will become that so now you can say things like remind the child you decide what you want not by other people's opinions or beliefs you decide what you want you decide what you want you keep telling what that does it it boosts the child's confidence like mom or dad says i decide what i want so it gives them the audacity to take up issues i'm not coward when these things come it, it gives them a voice it gives them the the audacity to stand to stand for themselves if there is no one around them to stand for themselves you can say things to them like failures are necessary to achieve success you yeah, see this one right here to, to get to that point because there are some people that once they just you know um get to any point where they feel like they failed yes they're like i'm a failure i can't know you you need to tell the child oh you failed oh good you can well, even like tell the child, the end, if you don't fail, how would you be successful? I'll so now that. that you have failed, what happened in that failure? What caused it? So this is necessary so that you can succeed. So let's try again. All right? Yeah, you can... Repeat, exactly. Like the failure is learning how not to, to do, do it. it the next yes. Time. yes. It just, just reminds me of Rita's story. Uh, Dr. Rita, you remember her, right? Mm -hmm. That came here once. I, I don't know. I've not seen her in a long time, actually. She came here and we're discussing about her medical school experience. She talked about how she had a carryover in a year, a particular year, and she kept pondering on how she was going to tell her dad, how was she mm -hmm. going to handle this and all that. But she eventually summoned the courage and told her father. Mm -hmm. And when she did, her father said, okay, just wait. And he went to say, I came out with a bottle of wine. And oh said, my I finally grew up. And this is so good because now you know how not to do it this way again. So what do you have to do differently? I'm like, then she started crying because she she had oh, thought, already wow, all we're heavens going were going to let loose. I've already disappointed them. So we really need to be there for our children yes. when they have a downtime like yes. that seemingly and encourage them yes. to fly above that absolutely. and do better. Absolutely, absolutely. Oh, what you hear more most more of the time is coconut head. <laughs> During your time. My During time. my time, rather. Oh, oh, so sorry. You know, uh -oh. when, you, when you said something about beauty, sometimes I ask myself, I don't know if... I can't remember. I don't know. My mom is... You always... There's this kind of... Like, someone said positive affirmations. I want to put it in a layman's language. like, hi. Yeah. First of all, they call it like, ah, oh, ah, baby girl, you. look how you're looking. You're, you're, the, you're the most beautiful person. <laughs> you know, so nobody can... Right from when I was growing to now... There are things that will happen to friends of mine, and I'm asking myself, like you, it, nobody can walk up to me and tell me, "El Giva, you are dumb," or "El Giva, you are not beautiful." Mm -hmm. I, I like, I look at myself in the mirror. Like somebody told me, you have, you don't know how to accept compliments, because you literally come and say, "Oh my God, you look so good." Like I know, like I saw you before I left my house. <laughs> so it's like, and I know I do it a lot. It's just my sister. Like I can just. Do want to be like ah ah guru you know book yes. ah you're so brilliant <laughs> my mom would just make her head baby girl you're looking so fine ah, ah, mm -hmm. I've never seen such a beauty in my life and I do it to my friends yes, so even good. like oh, it's possible affirmations it, but like I said layman in my head is like I'm happy these people yeah. and, 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 yes. and every yes, every the yes. thing is every human being needs that whether every your colleague human whether being. your, your friend whether it's a family member every human being needs that so at a time when you really want to give them a knock they will know it's a genuine knock yes even, even they people would, on they the street, they would take it seriously yeah. and know Compliments that, yes. that you give. It's, oh, my yes. Oh, I love your dress. Oh, oh your hair is beautiful. Such a beautiful and smile. you just move on. And that's how I do. So you're just so beautiful. And I'm gone. The, and, and, and that then, person will be feeling so good the whole day. And then sometimes that thing you said to that person might be all that person needed to just continue mm -hmm. on life that they were almost giving up on mm. you just say that word you know and then they, they just you know get all the energy like wow a total stranger wow 
and then they are filled with energy and they keep going on so now get going to affirmations there are so many other things that you can say but as i said earlier i'm going to put this on my handles on instagram and on face on facebook so that you yeah. can look at them so let me get you uh, sorry, to say no, something i was going to say one of our um someone on, on on whatsapp wants to know how they can reach you they're not on instagram or facebook so if there's a can you send send how the handles there if they're not on they are Instagram, not on, on Instagram yes. and she'd like you to can, you can you can you can reply her later maybe with your phone yes. number or something yes like yes, yes. 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 yes so we really Lizzie will just send you a private yeah. message all right yeah. okay so um we have to go we have to go we have to we have to go we have to go so many information on the it does take one i'm proud of myself i have a lot to offer exactly exactly i'm enough i get better every day i can i am smart i am sunshine people love me i am brilliant right so there are different affirmations for different age grades and as they you know as they progress you see that these things help them in different ways so um i hope you're able if you're listening you're an aunt an uncle a mom a dad a grandma a grandpa positive affirmations can get your children so far very, start it today very, very start it true today. we really have to go child right? your arm and go. thank you so much okay, and thanks Abuja. thank you for being a part of the adios. show tomorrow is a thursday we have a fresh dish all served ready for you who's that throwback mannequin challenge oh <laughs> Please, on Thursday we have to share that. Okay, we gotta go. My name is Rita. My name is Elgiva. My, My name is Tony. My name is Omelogo. And we're out. Bye. I have to go. Thank you so much for those who joined. I would have stayed on to give you these things, but I have to get a run. I need to do school runs. Right after that, once I'm done with school runs, I'll get back here and I will drop you some affirmations, age appropriate affirmations. All right? So just stay tuned. Thank you so much for joining Onine Carls. Dynasty. I see you all. I see you all. Thank you so much. Ciao, ciao, ciao. J Breeze 34. Mariel Bakehouse. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Do you have yourself an amazing, amazing new yeah, year? Yeah. I can go. Is that DJ Danny? Yeah. He's getting better. We don't quiet for you. Bye. <laughs> Hello Abuja, I am Tanya Kodia here.